Determination of crude fat content is a very important proximate analysis, especially for food and feed samples. This video represents the detailed and complete procedure of crude fat analysis. Welcome to the channel Microchems Experiments. Be with us, be a laboratory expert. This method is valid only for solid samples. To analyze a sample for crude fat determination, we have to go through the five simple steps. Thimble preparation, sample preparation, fat extraction, taking final weight and calculation. To do the analysis, we need some apparatus and equipment, like balance machine, filter paper, cotton cellulose thimble and hot air oven. We also need the Soxlet apparatus or Soxlet extractor. To carry out the whole test we only need N-hexane or other anhydrous dethyl ether. Let's go for the analysis. First of all we have to make a thimble with filter paper, to which the sample will be taken for testing. Firstly, take a square block of filter paper and make a narrow thimble with it by folding and wrapping. Staple one end of the thimble to seal that end. Place the thimble on the balance machine and tear its weight. Now we have to prepare the sample. Solid sample should be ground and crushed before testing. Take 1 to 5 grams of homogenized sample into the previously prepared thimble. Sample weight varies depending on the expected fat percent. Note the sample weight. Place small amount of cotton into the thimble to cover the sample. Close the opening end by folding the filter paper. Mark the thimble with sample number. Take a cellulose thimble and put in the enclosed sample into it. Take a cleaned and dried flat bottom flask of Soxlet apparatus. Take the weight of the flask and note it down. Now we are going to extract the fat content from the sample using Soxlet apparatus.
Set the Soxlet placing the prepared sample into it. Add sufficient amount of N-hexane. Turn on the cold water circulation through the condenser. Finally run the apparatus. Proper reflux rate is very critical to the complete extraction of fat. That's why set the temperature in such a way that maintain the reflux rate of 5 drops per second. N-hexane is used as a solvent for fat which dissolves out the fat from the sample to the flask. Run the apparatus for 6 hours. After 6 hours of extraction, raise the thimble out of solvent and collect the wastage N-hexane in a glass bottle. Now distill the hexane or solvent again as much as possible from the flask to reclaim hexane or solvent and attain apparent dryness. Collect the remaining hexane. Rotate the flask to evaporate the excess solvent or hexane. Now dry the flask in hot air oven at 110 degrees Celsius for 30 minutes. Cool the flask and desiccator.
Take the final weight of flask with fat. You can see the flat layer at the bottom of the flask. Now we have to calculate to find the percentage of crude fat content. To calculate the crude fat content first of all we have to put some values in the right side of the board. We took 4.7152 grams of sample for testing, that is why weight of sample WS is 4.7152 grams. We know the weight of empty flask W1 from our note, which is 115.5923 grams. We also know the weight of flask with fat, W2 is 116.6733 grams. Now we will put all of the values in the equation given in the left side of the board. W2 is 116.6733 minus W1 is 115.5923 WS is By solving the equation we get the crude fat percent is 22.92.